Top 12 iPhone shortcuts that I use every day to boost my productivity. So I bring this to you to make your daily iPhone use more efficient. Let's start with automated greetings. Never forget to send a birthday or anniversary message again with this thoughtful shortcut. Once you're in the Shortcuts app, tap on the plus icon to create a new shortcut. In the action search bar, type send message and select the you preferred message option. For example, I prefer iMessages to send a text message. After adding that, tap on the text field within the action to type out your greeting message. Next to the recipients field to choose a contact from your contact list. Then name it to the shortcut as you prefer. Then click on done to save the shortcut. To schedule when the message should be sent, you need to use automation. At the bottom tap on the automation icon to go to the automation tab, Tap on plus to create a new automation, select time of day to schedule when the message should be sent, and choose the specific dates and times. After setting the schedule, choose run immediately action in your automation. Then at the top right tap on next, and select the greeting shortcut you just made. This will link your scheduled time to the greeting message you created. Now, your iPhone will automatically send the greeting message at the scheduled times. Social media timer. Need a break from social media? Let's build a shortcut that starts a timer when you open apps like Instagram. In the Shortcuts app, tap on the plus icon to create a new shortcut. Then search for Open App in Add Actions and select it. After that, tap on App and select Instagram or any other social media app you want to set the timer for. Next, search for Start Timer from the Actions list. Tap on the time displayed in the action and set it to however long you want your social media session to last. For example, I will put one minute, give your shortcut a name like social media timer and tap done to save it. Now, every time you open Instagram from this shortcut, the shortcut will automatically start a timer in the background. It's a great way to remind yourself to take a break and not get too absorbed. Meal Planner. Organize your meals with a shortcut that shows your weekly meal plan. Make sure you create a weekly meal plan on Notes app. Then open Shortcuts app, click on plus icon to create new shortcut. Then in the action search bar, search for open notes. Once you find that there, select your weekly meal plan note. Now in the search bar, type add new reminder and select it. Now enter a title for your reminder, such as check weekly meal plan. Then add an alert at your required time. For example, I am adding every Sunday at 8 a.m. After that, name it to your shortcut as Meal Reminder for easy finding. Then add it to the home screen for easy access. Tap the shortcut to quickly view your weekly meal plan. Every Sunday at your set time, you will receive a reminder to check your meal plan, ensuring you're prepared for the week ahead. Morning Report Automation. This shortcut sends you a summary of your day when you stop your morning alarm. It'll tell you the weather, your first appointment, and even your commute time. Let's set it up together. Open the Shortcuts app. Go to Gallery tab. Search for Upcoming. Then add the Resulted option. Now go back to the Automation tab, then New Automation, and choose Alarm. Select Is Stopped, then select Run Immediately. At the top right, click on Next, and add Actions for Open Upcoming Events. So, if you have any events on your calendar, those will be shown up when you turn off alarm. Exercise Log Keep track of your fitness routine directly from your phone. Once you are in the Shortcuts app, click on the plus icon to create new shortcut. Here, in the Action Search Bar, search for the Log Workout and select it. Next, click on the Type to select what type of exercise you want to do. For example, I will select Running. Next. Click on the side arrow to add a few more details about your workout, like adding dates like ask each time or current date. Then set the duration. For this, I will choose ask each time because I want to set it manually. Remaining two calories and distance also I will set ask each time. Once it is done, I will rename this shortcut like log my exercise. So add this shortcut to your home screen for quick access. Whenever you want to start your exercise, simply tap this shortcut. Then adjust your specifications one by one. This shortcut will log your workouts into the Health app, helping you keep track of your fitness progress over time. Meditation Timer. Set up a serene meditation session with a shortcut that not only times your session, 
but can also play calming sounds. Tap on the plus icon to create a new shortcut. In the action search bar, type start timer and select it. Enter the duration you want for your meditation. For example, if you want a 15 minute session, just type 15 minutes into the timer duration. Next, if you have an Apple Music subscription, we'll add calming music to play during your meditation. For this, search for play music and select it. Here you can choose the music or search for the music if you have an Apple Music subscription. In my case, I don't have an Apple Music subscription. Once all set, name your shortcut, something descriptive like meditation timer. Tap done to save your shortcut. For easier access, you can add this shortcut to your home screen. Now, whenever it's time to meditate, just tap this shortcut and it will automatically set the timer and play if you select any calming music. This is a great way to have a peaceful and structured meditation session. Location reminder. Set reminders based on your location to remember tasks when you're near specific places. Tap on the plus to create a new shortcut. Then in the search bar, search for show notification and select it. Now enter the text which you want to display as a notification. For example, I will enter like this. Once you entered the text, name the shortcut as groceries reminder, then click on the done to save the shortcut. Now go to the automation tab. Look at the top right of the screen, click on the plus icon, then choose the arrive option here. Now add the location where you want. After that, select the distance how much before you want to get this reminder. Then choose the time. I am leaving it in any time. Then change it to run immediately. Now click on next and then select your groceries shortcut. You've successfully set up a location-based reminder. Now, whenever you arrive at the grocery store, your phone will remind you like this. Recipe finder. Find recipes based on the ingredients you have at home. Tap the plus icon to create a new shortcut. In the search bar that appears, type ask for input and select it. Set the prompt to what ingredients do you have? This will ask you to input the ingredients you want to use. Make sure the input type is set to text to allow freeform text entry. After setting up the input action, tap on the search bar below it to add another action. Search for search web and select it from the actions list. The text from the ask for input action will automatically be used as the search query. This action will use your default web browser to search for recipes based on the ingredients you entered. Next, name your shortcut Recipe Finder for easy reference, then click on Done to save this. Whenever you want to use this shortcut, simply tap it from within the Shortcuts app. Respond to the prompt by entering the ingredients you have, e.g. chicken rice peas. The shortcut will automatically search the web using your specified ingredients, pulling up a list of recipes that use them. Custom Morning Routine Let's streamline your mornings with a shortcut that opens your essential apps one after another. Just create a new shortcut. In the action search bar, type open app and select it. Then click on apps. Here, choose the first app you want to open, such as the news app. Repeat this step for each app you want to include in your routine, like weather and calendar and any other important things. Each app will be a new open app action within the same shortcut. Once you've added all your apps, you can arrange the order in which they open. Next, you can name your shortcut, such as morning routine. Then tap Add to Home Screen for easier access. This lets you place the shortcut on your home screen, just like an app icon. Now, when you tap this shortcut icon from your home screen, it will sequentially open the News app, followed by Weather and then Calendar or whichever apps you've chosen, automating your morning info gathering. Next is Quick Email, perfect for sending preset messages. Just click on plus icon to create a new shortcut, add the Send Email action, and pre-fill the details. You can even add recipients and a subject. Then click on Done to save the shortcut. Now, with one tap, you can send that message without typing anything. Text to speak. This one's a lifesaver if you multitask. Tap the plus icon to create a new shortcut. In the search bar, type Speak Text and select it. Then add clipboard action to it. Also, you can customize the voice by tapping on the Show More option. Here, you can select a different voice or adjust the speaking rate to make it slower or faster according to your preference. Then, give it a relevant name like Speak Clipboard Text. Tap on Done to save your shortcut. To test your new shortcut, 
Copy some text from anywhere on your iPhone, like a note, a web page, or a book. Then, run your shortcut by tapping it from within the Shortcuts app. If none of the above methods works, and you are sure that the charging port has been damaged, you may try to contact customer service. Now, you can listen to articles or notes while on the go. PDF Converter. Turning web pages or documents into PDFs is super handy. To set up this shortcut, open the Shortcuts app. Tap on the plus icon to create a new shortcut, and add the Make PDF action. You'll need to specify what you want to convert into a PDF. Then, optionally, you can add an action called Show Notification. After adding Name to the notification what you want, then add the Save File action. Give your shortcut a name that reflects its function, like Convert to PDF. Finally, tap Done to save your shortcut. Now if you copy any web pages or URL, then go to Shortcuts app to run your shortcut. Now whenever you need to convert something into a PDF, just run this shortcut from your Shortcuts library to save the PDF into your Files app. And that's it. Try them out, customize them to fit your needs, and see just how much more efficient your day can be. If you have any shortcut ideas, just comment below.